my name is Brent with Lift Ray and Toulon, and today we are talking about something huge. This is the Ryobi work surface for the Link Mobile Toolboxes. Why is this so important and why is it so big? Well, close to a year ago when they first came up with the toolboxes, they didn't come up with a work surface, so I designed and I built one, how to attach it and all that great stuff. Well, when I was selling them, I was selling a ton of them, but I wasn't really doing it for profit. I just wanted to help the community, and it just didn't make sense for me to do it. It was so labor-intensive. It was so much work. I stopped selling them like three months into it. I just couldn't do it anymore. But I have so many people that would like one of these surfaces. I've been doing a ton of design, a ton of redoing it in the manufacturing process and all that great stuff. And I am very happy to announce that I am making these again. Now, these are a bit different. As you can tell, this surface is a little bit more clean and it is laser engraved. And that's my nice little take on the, the Ryobi sign because people are so proud of it and love the brand and the community and the innovation. So that comes on it, but it gets a little bit better than that. Now, I did a full video and I'll put that video down below of the previous one. But for this sake, you're not only going to get laser engraved and all that good stuff. This is also, I'm going to do a custom for people too. This is for a customer uh, or just a big fan of Ryobi. He actually just wanted his clan's seal. And this is Sinclair. It's a Scottish name. And this is his family's motto. And he sent it to me. I was able to download it, work through my graphics design program threw it on the laser, was able to get this done. Now, the reason why I'm able to do this so much more efficiently is I'm utilizing different technology. So the cuts on this are perfect for one big reason. I'm now using a large CNC machine to mill everything out to make it perfect. That's really gonna help us. I actually finish it all by hand because I wanna make sure that I provide a really good quality product have my little emblem on the back there. I designed and I created these little link connectors here. And since it's not like a mechanically locking link, I put this little bolt in there. And what that does is it catches on the back lip to help it, you know, not slide out because it isn't too friction based. It, I mean, it will slide, so you don't want it to slide. So you gotta be careful about that stuff. But you're able to use this as a nice work surface for whatever you wanna put on it. And you know what? It's cool to have an emblem here if you really want it, but this is a work service. You don't need it. So you really get that choice. So I'm going to give people a custom board choice and then a standard board choice on there as well. But it's super easy uh, to connect, as you see here. It's super easy to work with. And I'm just really happy with the technology between the CNC cutting, between the 3D printing, between the lasers and everything that come out with there. This is just a really clean, nice board. Now I did leave some of the holes here for straps. If you want to use straps and really tie things down here, I think that's going to be a really added bonus if you really want to. If you don't and you just want to use as a flat, nice surface that you can remove and put back, that's really up to you too. But anyways, I wanted to announce this and let everybody know that I am going to put these back on the market. I'm so happy to be able to do this until Ryobi comes out with a mechanically locking work surface. I will try to support the community as much as possible. I'll put a link to it down below if you are interested. Now it's not going to be cheap. I am doing this by hand and it takes a very long time to create this. So don't be surprised. I do value my time. And everybody, please get out there, work with your hands, do something. That's the whole mission. That is what I want to see. And that's my whole goal right now is to get people using their hands, building things, learning and growing, making mistakes, learning from those mistakes and passing it on to the next generation. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Please like the video if you think it's a good idea. And I hope to see everybody in the next video. Take care.